Hi, I'm Dave Veith with P MP Systems. Uh, today I want to talk about pole ground hazards. Uh, everybody heard about the old timers that used a leather glove uh, off the pole. Um, the guys that survived that practice learned two things. To work on a dry pole and, and to stay clear of pole grounds or any kind of ground. A um, couple of things to remember is if you're working up on a pole and you're going to be any, in any vicinity of a ground, eliminate that by cutting it. It can be spliced back together afterwards. If you're going to be working up there and there's a pole ground going up the pole, cut it down below you. Um, another hazard that happens, you see this down in the Milwaukee area, you have an arrester with a ground that goes down the arm and you can see right here that you got a potential to go phase the ground. So you come over to a location where you can splice this back together again, cut it, eliminate that potential, and it makes this a much safer. This even goes not just for working off the pole, but also working out of a bucket. Obviously phase the ground right here in front of your face. Another third, a third problem is if you're setting a pole in hot primary, you don't want this ground wire coming right down to where it's going to be right in your face uh, or by your hands or by your body. You can cut this ground wire before you set the pole uh, with the intent to sleeve it back together once you get the pole set. Just make sure you cut this above uh, where you're going to be in contact with that pole after it's in the ground. You can also don't staple it all the way down. You can coil it up and tack it up above your head and then you don't have that issue either. You can set the pole without the ground wire on it. it makes a lot of work in the end. Uh, one more thing that I wanted to talk about. This is something that I was caught up in. Burnt. Uh, un ground, or, uh, uninsulated guy wires. Um, it's basically another ground. So you always got to watch for those also. Don't be standing on one of them when you're working primary. It's the same as a ground wire. That finishes uh, what I have to say about pole ground hazards.